Hey friends, I'm at Epcot today and today is National Umbrella Day and it happens to be pouring out. Well, it was pouring out. Now it's kind of clearing up, but it probably will rain again later. So I brought some umbrellas to Epcot with me. I'm gonna hand them out to some people, try to dry them up and cheer up their day. It's not fun getting stuck in the rain at the park without an umbrella or a poncho. It's very costly because it does cost a lot of money. It definitely costs a lot of money at Disney. So, uh, let's go do this. Guys, would you like some umbrellas for later? Uh, oh, thanks. I mean, it's better, yeah. <laughs> Keep you a little dry, two of you. Enjoy. You're welcome. There's also something else I wanted to talk about about the umbrellas. So earlier when I went to go get the umbrellas, I usually go to the same place and they were sold out of umbrellas. And they usually only cost like $1.50, $2. So I went to another place, right? And they had the same exact umbrellas, right? And I went up and asked how much they were and they told me $3.50, right? And they were the same exact umbrellas that I would get for a $1, $1.50. So I was like, okay, whatever, I guess I'll just buy less, you know? Well, I've been looking at the price tags on these and they say 250. I feel like I've been played or hustled. I think they knew it was raining out and they knew that those umbrellas were a necessity. So they, uh, they got me, they got me good. Hey guys, would you, do you guys want some umbrellas for later? I have some extra ones. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> enjoy. Or maybe they knew it was National Umbrella Day. Ha <laughs> ha, it's all coming together now. Wow, pretty monorail. I love monorail and flowers. Those two go together so nice. Thank you. Hey, you picture people. You want some umbrellas? Oh. Yeah, there you go. Stay dry gonna take a little pit stop and go into the Disney Rewards photo spot see who's lurking in there because it's so pretty I come here often very very often mostly because of the Epcot mountains that's what they look like right they look like spaceship yeah, earth do. mountains yes, they do. or the spaceship earth wall look at how <laughs> fancy that is and these Fancy malls. The monorail chugging up the mountain. Oh, and Minnie and Pluto. Hey. <laughs> hey, hey guys. Hey, how are you? Yeah, hi, Pa. Hi, Pa. Hi. Oh, well, thank you very much. Thank you very much. That was a lick. I appreciate that. You have the coolest whiskers. I really am. <laughs> Wait, can I? Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I don't have any whiskers. Oh wait, I do have whiskers. No, I don't. I mean, I have a, I have a, I have a mustache. That's not a mustache at all. Oh, okay. Well, I guess uh, let's take a photo because it's Spaceship Earth. Amazing. The reason I like that character meet and greet is because it's secluded, it's quiet, there's not a long line usually, and you're in your separate area, like by yourself, you know what I mean? So you don't have to, I don't know, it's more intimate. They spend more time, they play around, it's very fun. So if you have a chase card through Disney or anything like that, uh, use that there. I know the $49 annual fee is a little yikes, but it is worth it. Hey, you guys got uh, any umbrellas or ponchos? You want an umbrella? Oh, sure. Yeah, later it's going to rain. Awesome. I got two. You. Yeah. There you go. Thank, Thank you. you. Enjoy. Thank you. Hey, uh, guys, you want to ride Fast Pass? You want to go in the Fast Pass line? Yeah, come on over. Yeah, give it to them because I already went to go meet some characters. Oh, well. There you go, guys. Enjoy. Yeah, go ahead. Take it. Thank you. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Have a great one. <laughs> no wait! <laughs> you know, one thing that really kind of I don't think is right is the fact that they made that meet and greet uh, tier one fast pass. So you'd have to choose that over test track, Soren, Frozen, Illuminations. So that's why if I always see it available and I don't have any plans, 
I like to try to get the fast pass and then try to give it off to somebody else because it's kind of a way for them to pick that. It's just something nice to do. And look at this, I've never seen this before, but when it rains during the Festival of the Arts, the chalk artists actually come under like a little covered area and make some chalk portraits. I think that's amazing. And they're very good too, look at her. Oh wow, for that steer. I said it right without looking at the name, I guess. And that gentleman over there. Sometimes it is very cool just to come to a park, walk around by yourself and take everything in. But to be honest, I miss my wife. I mean, I know some people do say, oh, it'd be so great to just go hang out by yourself. Not really. I mean, she's at work. I have to go to work later. But like I said, it was National Umbrella Day. I couldn't, I couldn't do it. I had to, I had to do it. So I went on without her, but she's here with me in spirit. Love you. This is where the 3D artists usually are, but as you can tell, because of the rain, they put some sandbags down, looks like some cover, and then they aborted mission. They were like, abort mission, abort mission. But look, they're still, they're still there. I like it. Monorail. Wait for it. Thank you. I stumbled upon the paint by number and it is the monorail. So yes, I will. But first I got on the wrong side of the line. So I had to come to the other side and actually get in line to get my paint. All the way in ladies. Ladies, come all the way in, please. All right, you're gonna be painting on our mural today. Oh. You're gonna get paint with a number on it, just like this. You're gonna paint only that number. You'll do five squares each, that way everybody has an opportunity to take part. This paint does not wash out of your clothing. <laughs> Fair warning, you see. Yes. I'm just here for breakfast. Thank you. For me. Thank you. Thank you. I'm doing 13. Lucky 13. Lucky 13 is the actual monorail. The white part of it. Oh boy. Oh, I see a blank canvas. I'm sorry. Okay. We're going to go right here. Only five squares. One, two, Three. Uh oh, not on the black, not on the black. Four, five. Very nice. I'm not a great painter. Who is SD? Huh. Did you do that? Uh huh. You must be Steve Datmer. Steve, D I just made that name up. Steve Datmer. <laughs> and check this out. Ran into some friends and they're going to paint the monorail. Ooh, oh, she got the same kind as me. Oh, wow, I should have went for that spot. I picked a horrible spot. <laughs> and then once you're done, you throw this in here, that in there, and then you return your paint-covered card. You don't have to, you can keep it. I'll keep it forever. You can keep it forever. Send it to your mom. Oh, and then you thank Gideon. <laughs> Flower and Garden Festival coming soon. Check that out. Okay, I think I'm done with today. I had a lot of fun hanging out at Epcot. And I get to take a little bit of Epcot home with me in the form of paint. So, love the life you live. And live the life you love. We'll see you next time. Toodaloo. Oh, by the way, Bridget, I loved your bow. I wonder if they'll let me in the picture.